it's mfx welcome back to another video so today we're going to be talking about a breakdown trade i'm not quite sure if i released the video yet on youtube regarding a trade i took on crude oil right and your entries or the entry that i ideally utilized is not your ideal type of entries right hence i've been actually showing a few hints this past few days regarding what many ict students see in regards to um pdras and what i see right everything is time based to be specific it is quarter base what was i looking for okay if i just show that this was a real execution right probably have the video out i'm going to be releasing one of the videos first right okay so ideally this range was price drawing lower to go higher right been explaining this pretty much since right it was a q2 i mean a new york session model right in regards to what i was trading right but yeah so the rules are still basic and it's predefined price needs to sweep the previous quarter ranges right this this and this right then price distributes lower right that we get our form of displacement that we look for higher price right but yeah a few things and a few ways to trust this profile right why i took it right and trusted it was mainly because price needs to be reacting of something here and it needs to be time based right so if i go to the 45 minute time frame because that is ideally the one that i was using right and let's zoom into the chart like that right we have this fair value gap right here notice where it formed it formed at 9 a.m new york time right then notice where it react 9 a.m new york time and what makes it high probability is the fact that it formed within q3 so ideally i was referring back to the previous day range which is this right there q3 of q3 right so if we are to drag this range like this it will be something like this right so we can call this um am new york we can call this an am new york q3 pd right that formed on the 45 minute time frame if i'm not using the 45 then i'm using the 90 minute i really never touch the one hour i do not trust it right if you want to use it that's fine and it's permissible i just don't use it yeah i don't touch it at all right okay so that that was our bias price sweeping the london low the quarter one low and tapping into this time-based pdra right which formed within the same quarter just the previous day right so my entries entry was ideally still the same logic right it's just that with this one i was referring back to this right here meaning if i am to remove this and this just to hide the noise and we already know the price is reacting of this right so we already know that then this range right here this is q3 right if we focus on the micro cycles then we can disable everything else no well, let's but yeah let's leave this one on right so notice that my trade was in 9:45, right just right there but i was not taking the trade because of this favorability gap right here if you want to trade like that 
that is ideally valid it's fine right but that's not the reason why price is going to where it's going right everything is time based meaning every price fluctuation is time based it's price reacting based on specific inefficiencies that form at a specific price range right i'll be going into more details about this as soon as the discord is ready right but yeah for now i believe that this should be enough just to yeah have a basic understanding so if we come to this range right here that's really form right there so we can just take q4 right from q4 okay this from q4 like this this was by q4 q4 yes right we need to redo that from q4 q4 right we have this favorably gap right here that formed within q3 right q3 and q2 so ideally when it's the candle that's divide that's within both ranges i use it for both either q q2 or q3 the same way this candle right here or we can say this one right here right this candle for me is both within q q3 and q4 right so it's the same exact same thing with this one as you can see it right there right and then we drag this to the right like that so if we go into current price just notice our price we x off it right there within like this range like this into quarters within the exact same price range price distribute higher right that was ideally my entry and yeah this is just a minor explanation for why i took this trade it was ideally not more than that right and you just basically got to practice this and learn how to see them because even when i'm managing my trades i'm looking for the same things right yeah but i'll be releasing a video if it's not yet out in regards to this trade as it plays through and then you'll notice that there's a lot more to it that's explaining everything visually right there's no audio but yeah hopefully you found this insightful and yeah hope everybody has a nice day